Hey guys, welcome back, and today I'm going to be showing you how to dive bomb in the SPD Dauntless. I mean, sure, anybody can dive bomb the SPD Dauntless, but are they doing it right? There's a bagillion ways to dive bomb, and you might not know which one is the right way. Mine, I think, is the right way. It is the right way, because I've seen many people do it. I've seen World War II documentaries. Now... You can carpet bomb, of course, but the original way with the SPD Dauntless is by dive bombing, of course. It's a dive bomber. Now, I'm gonna, now taking off is easy, but not like this. So, I will show you how to dive bomb, and that will be pretty much it. I mean, you could do it your way, or you could do it the right way, but, you know, I'm not saying that you're doing the wrong way. Just showing you how you're supposed to do it. Not saying that you don't know how to do it, but... Let's get to it. When you're climbing, this this BD Dauntless is pretty good, but it's not that good of a climber. It'll take you a, quite a while, and you can see I'm already doing a very, very smooth climb, and I'm already losing a lot of speed. Now, this BD Dauntless dives from 8,000 feet, and you might be like, Wow, that is very high, and it will take a long time. Well, it's a long ways. It is a very long ways, especially in just thing. Now, dogfighting. There's this ace in World War II who first started off in an SPD Dauntless. He was fighting against three Japanese Zero, and he killed each one of them. And then he later went on to fly the F6F, no, the F4F Hellcat, or Wildcat, right? God. <clears throat> Sorry about that, but when you dive, you want zero throttle. Even if AA is hitting you, you want zero throttle. You go too fast, your plane's gonna be shaking. And not in the fun way, it's gonna be shaking to where it's almost impossible to aim. And going slower will make it so you're not over shooting your target. Happened to me a bunch of times when I was diving down, 100% power, trying to bomb where your aircraft can get out of sight. So that's a good idea of putting 0% throttle. And another way to make it even better is putting your flaps to 100%. By doing that, you're making your air brakes even stronger. And when you take off, or when you climb back up, it will help. Now we are in 6,000 feet, we're supposed to be in 8,000, so I'm going to try and hurry up to that altitude. But, it doesn't look like I'm going to have enough time, maybe I am. Now, you could always do the tutorial in the game to how to dive bomb, of course. But I'm just showing you in just video how to do it. So yeah, you want 8,000 feet, which is not where you are, I don't think. Want to get over your target, as you see here. Put your throttle to zero percent. Flaps to a hundred. Now we are ahead of our target, which is not bad whatsoever. It's actually yeah, perfect. Wait. So. Let's go. Stop. So we're diving. Fish come up. Stop. Okay, so, there's our target. At 2,000 feet, you want to drop it. And drop it. Then you want to go 100% throttle, pull up, and watch the fireworks. So there's not much to it. And then you want to pull up till you don't have a lot of speed so you can put your flaps down or up. And that is pretty much all you have to it. A thousand pound bombs does not do a lot of damage, so I'd recommend you doing it on the destroyer. But then again, what the heck. This plane is very, very beautiful and can turn with the zeros quite a bit. I was in my P-38 where two SBD Dauntless, they're buddies, and literally outmaneuvered me. Out, they outdid everything. <coughs> They even killed me four times. It was really impressive. And I underestimate them. And 
like Bowtime said, never underestimate the SPD Dauntless. This thing is just amazing. Now, no need to show you how to land the aircraft. Just let's go exit the game, and I gotta go next door. So, don't forget to share this video and subscribe today to, to see more videos like this. And we have four, no, 14 subscribers. We need one more and we complete our goal of 15 subscribers. And I will lay off saying subscribe to me a little bit. Well, I say subscribe, but like. I won't be as worried because I mean 15 subscribers guys now 900 XP pretty good now I used to have 12,000 ground kills and 3,000 air kills until I installed my game by accident but other than that guys hope you have enjoyed this video thanks for watching I'll see you next time like this video and share and subscribe today this is overdrive to help I know signing off and I'll see you next time